You're learning about legal options today because you've been injured and feel that the injury was not your fault but was caused by the actions of others. To put it in legal terms, you have a personal injury case. For the next few minutes, we'll discuss some of the key elements of a personal injury case and try to answer some of the most frequently asked questions. Only your attorney can advise you regarding the circumstances of your particular case, but we can provide background information that will help you prepare for the process. The law says you are entitled to be restored to the condition you were in before your injury and that you must be compensated for that injury, any disability you have suffered, any loss in earning capacity that results from your injury, and any lost property. The fact that you have been injured, however, is no guarantee that you will receive compensation. To settle your case, your attorney must persuade the party responsible for your injury that the incident occurred as you say it did, that you have been harmed, and that you deserve compensation. Usually, if the other party is persuaded, your case can be settled without going to court. If the other party refuses to accept responsibility for the injury or disagrees regarding the amount of compensation, your case may have to be resolved or settled in a trial. Or you may be able to take advantage of a process called Alternative Dispute Resolution, or ADR. In either case, you and your attorney will be working together as partners. To demonstrate how this partnership works, we'll follow a typical personal injury case.